After the last two years with Dimitri, I thought we'd seen every battlefield there is to see in Fargus. The Magdred Way, huh? This one's new. Uh, a little foggy, don't you think? I might even hazard to call it a lot foggy. You've never fought in conditions like these, so you do well to keep what wits you have about you. If you're not careful in this fog, you could find yourself walking straight off a cliff. Horrible way to go, if you ask me. Come on, you're not my mom. I can handle myself. <laughs> wow, look who woke up on the confidence side of the bed. If that's how you feel, maybe you don't even need my help anymore. You know what? Yeah. Why don't you set this one out? I've got a thing or two I can show you. Oh, don't be ridiculous. And, just in case you forgot, if you die, I go with you. Our fates are intertwined, so don't do anything too reckless, you understand? Now come on, let's go. I'm ready to be battling. For House Voldarius. I won't let you down. Do what I need to. Reporting for duty. Telling where our enemies might be lurking in this fog. Leave it to me. Let's team up. I'll do my best. We'll win if we work together. Begin the operation. Allow me to begin the operation. Hear you loud and clear. I might just be able to be at the ready for potential ambushes. Hey, you lack the luxury of waiting for it to clear. Renato must be found and put to the sword as soon as possible. We will begin by advancing our front line. All forces, prepare to march. We will proceed. We move. Now. I'll do what I can. We march. On me. Let's be Come with me. No backing down. Not even against the king himself. We fight for Lord Lonato. I can barely see my hand in front of my face. Hey, 
Didn't we bring torches? I can see way better now. This will make moving around a lot easier, too. This moment. This isn't a battle. It's a bloodbath. We were set out here like lambs to the slaughter. This is almost too easy. Press our advantage. Allow me Everyone, to stand fall back. Down. We need to regroup. All is proceeding apace, but don't let up. And keep an eye out for enemies. Time to get to work. This must be reinforcements from the Empire. Everyone, guard yourselves! <laughs> Didn't think I'd get another shot at the Ashen Demon this soon. You're more capable than I expected. They're holding back. So much for gauging their strength. Take a breather. I've got this. Let's begin. It's time. on my orders. Is that Wigwam? From House Gautier? What is he doing here? So, my brother is joining us. Looks like his majesty really pulled out all the stops. I'll stop the enemy dead in their tracks. You ought to use your brains and figure out how we win this thing. Someone must be giving these mercenaries their orders. We are going to find them. Nikon can handle things on his own. I didn't expect they'd have reinforcements, but it doesn't change much. You know what we're doing. I'll do what I can. It's worth a shot. We will proceed as planned. We must strive to perform to the best. Let's begin. Come with me. You have to do. All that's left is to do. Are you seriously going to sit back and let someone else handle the Ashen Demon for you? new to Gerald's band, but my only hope is that I don't get you all killed. That funeral would truly be a grave affair. All right, let's go! We'll do it together! I've got you now! Witness my true power! Come then, let us fight with honor! 
We'll do it together! I've got you now! I'll do what I can. I'm here to- Hold the position. None of them get through. Enough of this foolishness. They were a formidable opponent. Would that we could have finished them here. Greed in battle will only end in tragedy. So, they beat the kid. These kingdom folks are tougher than I thought. Not on my watch! The lover... Not a problem. Move out. Take the lead. Begin the operation. Let's give them a nice, warm welcome. Ten? Tough. These are no ordinary mercs. Mercs link up. All right, let's go! We'll do it together. My turn. Defense. 
the position. Show them how firmly our defenses can hold. Subterfuge has passed. We shall meet now in honest combat. <laughs> Victory will be ours, Lenato. Come, everyone. We will overwhelm our foes. <laughs> to ingratiate himself with the Empire. We can't exactly leave our new friend to die, can we? No, not now. Lenato is but one step away. If we can just try to reason with Dorothea then, we might be able to settle things peacefully. The might of Adrestia is on our side. It is. With our combined forces. I've 
got this. Let's begin. I'll do what I can. Need to stop them before they call for backup. I shall take the lead. Not a problem. I've got it. <laughs> Go get him, your majesty! Not your day, huh? Sit! You're helping too, Sylvain! Stand down! Take a breather. Yeah, a moment too soon. Dorothea, please. I don't want to see you die for nothing. I can't say I want that either. All right. Leave me. If His Majesty means to shelter those vile church brats, then I shall rebuke them to my final breath. Fling open the gates! I've got this. I'll do what I can. I'm here to help! I have burned far too many bridges to turn back now. It's time to settle this. Hold the position. None of them can do it. All right, let's go! We'll do it together. I've got you now. Consider, Your Majesty, the Central Church's blessing is not for a poisoned chalice. Forgive me, Lord of but I must blast it all the same. This is the brightest future I can give my people. See Kristoff avenged, even at the cost of my own life. The way it is allow me. Apologies. Do what I must. Oh, step aside, Ash. I have a duty to cast up my youth. As do I. The duty of a knight to his kingdom. I've never betrayed that. Keep your strength. My turn. Forgive your fool of a father, Kristoff, for he is soon to join you. All right, let's go! We'll do it together! Battle is over. A fine effort, everyone. Especially considering the conditions. Guess we did our job at least. Well, well, doesn't someone sound disappointed? And what's with that look? I don't know. We completed our mission and all, but it still feels like we lost somehow. Sure, we stopped Lenato, and we put Geralt and his mercenaries to rout. 
but not before they dragged us through one of the toughest fights we've experienced. And most of all, I failed to take down the Ashen Demon. If that's not a loss, I don't know what is. Wrong! You were hired to do a job, and you did it. And in the process, you've received a valuable reminder about the unique danger the Ashen Demon poses. You're right. I can't believe one fighter could turn the tide of an entire battle like that. Precisely. They're surely going to continue standing in our way, so do try to dig a little deeper the next time you square off. Yeah, you're probably right. Thanks for the chat. By the by, have you seen our valiant leader? I wonder where he scampered off to. Hmm, no Felix or the others in sight either. Maybe they're having a meeting or something. Sounds like you should try to track them down then, though on second thought, it may not be any of your business. They might be friends, but they're also my clients. I shouldn't stick my nose in their private affairs. What a touching show of camaraderie. In that case, we should get some rest. There are plenty more battles ahead of us. Hesitate no longer. This strength will serve. I've grown a lot. Just look at me go! I cannot grow complacent. One step closer to... Can't let... You did well, Miklana. I will remember the deeds you've performed here today. <laughs> you know as well as I that I only did it for the money. Your money. What are you playing at, Boar? This washed-up bandit doesn't deserve to look at our army, let alone be a commander in it. It's a decision I made in collaboration with the Margrave. Two years ago, after I ascended the throne, I ordered Gustav to capture him, made him swear his allegiance to the royal family, and gave him a unit of soldiers to command. Spare me the details of how you did it. What I want to know is why. My army was lacking leaders. We needed capable fighters to fill in the gaps. As for Miklon here, the Margrave himself has instructed him in all manner of military tactics. I've seen his prowess with my own two eyes. <sighs> in the centuries since the time of King Lug, crests and relics have kept Fargus safe. We've come to depend on that power to protect us from outside attacks, and grown all too complacent in its wake. Naturally, we will take full advantage of our hero's relics in the battles ahead with Adrestia. But we cannot protect our home with relics alone. If all who could wield them fell, so too would we. The blood of the heroes is thinner now than ever before. We need men like him among our ranks. I don't doubt the truth of your words, but that's not the issue here. Do you really think it appropriate to trust a man barely removed from his life as a brigand with the responsibility of command? Everyone's heard the stories of the elder Gautier brother, how he resorted to banditry and plunder. Do you not think our soldiers would object to being led by a man with such history? 
<laughs> Command, huh? It's got a nice ring to it. But you should know, I'm just a prisoner. My attendants, my aides, my best men, all stooges for the royal family. Breathing down my neck every waking moment. All the sleeping moments, too. No wise remarks, Sylvain? You're standing there mute, as if this has nothing to do with you. I was one of the first His Majesty consulted with. There's nothing I could say that I haven't already. I'm sure you can't stand the sight of me, Miklon. But let's see if we can't get along, okay? Huh. <laughs> anyway, now that we're all caught up, I'll await your next orders, Your Majesty, Sir. Let me guess. Any means necessary? I won't defend it. Though I do see use in such a man. What he did in his time as a bandit was monstrous, I admit that. And I deserve no small amount of judgment for giving him command in spite of it. But I can't help but wonder. Perhaps his life could have been dramatically different had he only possessed a crest. Same as the uncle I murdered. I understand your reasoning, Your Majesty. Yet he's hurt so many people. What's done is done. Stolen goods may be returned, but stolen lives cannot. If the man is unwilling to atone for his wrongdoings, then he will pay for it with his head. If he does wish to repent, however, then what better way to do so than by risking his life on behalf of our people? If any among us still can't forgive him, by all means, take up your arms and enact vengeance. I get what you're trying to do, but you still should have talked to us first. This isn't about who shoulders what blame. It's a matter of letting us know what you're thinking. <sighs> you're right, Felix. My apologies. Now then, we march on Aryan Road as planned. With House Rose military might crippled, seizing the fortress should be a somewhat simpler matter. Silver Maiden, can we really take it? You saw how many troops they've already lost. Just plain math will tell you there can't be that many of them left back at the fortress. At least I sure hope not. And I am sure Houses Karen and Geraint would be willing to lend us a few squadrons in return for the aid we provided them. Agreed. And their militaries are both formidable indeed. I'll have to factor their support into our strategies moving forward. And what of you, Ash? Will you be joining the fight at Aryan Road? I... Yes, I will. Though I do appreciate the concern, Your Majesty. As long as you're sure you can handle it. Do not hesitate to retreat if it becomes too much for you. House Rose forces aside. We now have the added threat of Gerald and his mercenary band to contend with. The very same mercenary band you had been looking for, is it not? Yeah. One of them in particular, a warrior known as the Ashen Demon, felled my entire company back before I met you. Not sure I'm looking for revenge exactly, but I do want to surpass them, no matter what it takes. I see. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Sorry, I wasn't really trying to hide it or anything. Just never came up, I guess. I believe I understand. Overcoming Gerald and his mercenaries is what drives you in life. Yeah, you could say that. It's the closest thing to a goal I have, for sure. Hmm. In any case, those people cannot be taken lightly. I'd like to avoid crossing blades with them as much as we can. Though we'll likely encounter them sooner rather than later. Imperial forces are still encamped in the former Arendelle territory, after all. Right. We'd better be ready for anything.